Hey everybody, welcome to Next Commentary, I'm playing Blitzcrank here. Um, again, this looks like Taric. We'll see how that goes. For Blitzcrank, I mean, it's pretty standard about how you're supposed to play. I mean, you just throw out your hook, if it lands, it's good. There's super small things that can make it so you can land more hooks, like throwing it really close to minions by... Like if Olaf was a minion here... If Olaf was a minion, um, I would put my mouse directly right next to him, and then when the person's CSing, they normally run back and forth between the casters, and then you can throw it right next to them, sometimes when they're moving across, and you can catch them off guard. There's super small stuff like that. Holy shit, I used a lot of mana, and my mana regen is actually so small. So I think I'll reset... No, I'll stay, whatever. My regen is actually probably gonna be up enough. coming. I don't know if there's people just chilling inside this brush. I'm gonna board this too. We can look for them if they leash and we can just pull one of them over because he asked for a leashless which is really good for us. We might be able to get something off of it. If they want to play safe then they will go um this way around going around that way but we'll see. It should have showed by now. Probably not there. Hmm, that wasn't very good. It's okay though. It's like pretty even trade, just Terra has healing and I don't. About it. They're gonna get level 2 on us, but we don't have heal advantage, that's that's one huge thing inside of Ezreal lane, so... Killing basically will be based off of what hook I can land on Caitlyn, basically. And most high elo players are able to stand behind minions pretty well, so it's pretty difficult to actually land a hook on them. Otherwise, Blitzcrank will just be a later pick machine. And we don't have to focus on laning at all, so we'll see what happens, but... I'm waiting for the cannon. It'll give me way more gold than everything else, but I don't know if I'll be allowed to step up for it. No, we should be able to, actually. Ah. That right there was when I was trying to do the trick, where it's like, she's standing basically super close to the minion, and it might actually not hit the minion and hit her. But it didn't, unfortunately. Can't really step up for this creep. He should be able to auto it. That'd be fine. Shit, he just took so much damage there. And you auto that one? There. Ooh. Okay, we got her flash. We won't be able to get a kill or anything, so. What the? Why did they ignite me? It's weird. It's okay. They used heal, right? No, they didn't use heal. They actually... I sh should have not pinged that. The only bad news now is I'm pretty freaking low. So if I accidentally hook in Taric or something, I can, I'll probably have to flash. She is just eating these hooks. I don't know why she keeps on walking away from her minion wave to like put down vision and stuff. It's really weird. So now we got their heal out. Olaf comes, I might be able to flash on top of her. I don't have Aftershock up though, so that's an important cooldown to look at. Maybe 
we actually kill her? I'm worried. No, I think we got her. We have Blob coming too? He has no flash, fuck. He's actually just gonna get away. We'll be able to burn maybe Taric Flash here. And that's it. Oh wait, right here, right here. I'll be able to hit her, nice. My Q came off cooldown and we were able to slow her, nice. Good job. They don't have TP, so we should shove this out the best we can. The reason why I went for the flash there was because we saw that Olaf was like nearby river, and I thought that maybe he would get there a little bit faster. He actually doesn't have boots, so I would say I, I probably should have played that a little bit slower, but I'm glad it worked out. It's good to realize like when you do something good, but it was just poor execution. Like the idea was good, right? But I probably could have played it a little bit slower and uh, it would have been a little bit better. But that's okay. Whoops, didn't mean to buy that. Oh my gosh. Oh, never mind. I thought he had one more gold than me. Feels bad, but we're actually even. Completely even with Targons. It's pretty funny. Normally people like mess up and they get a caster minion or something and then of course the other person will have more targ Targon because uh, one person misses a cannon and suddenly they're down like 70 gold. There you go. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm getting hardcore minion blocked. So Tarek's gonna come back, we have a giant wave to catch, so we'll just catch it. I doubt that we can really do anything here, unless like I get a disgusting pull off. So what is she doing? Can you just auto her down? No? I guess not. I guess they have too much healing, but that's okay. We once again got another good pull because she like is just allowing me to pull her every single second, so. She like tries to net away when my hook is just so long now, so. Ooh, he got a tower, tower shot. Okay, we just back off here. We wait for the next hook. Oof, that was a lot of damage. I don't have my Targons or anything here, so I can't really help my AD carry. I'll ping out that. This guy used Flash, too. Three seconds, next hook. We have an Ocean Dragon, so Ocean Dragon's really gonna help us, too. So I'm gonna put a ping behind us, just so we don't get, like, suddenly collapsed on by a Tully or something. Ooh, that was close. I was trying to, like, predict the Caitlyn movement. You can see that she was moving to the left there. So I'm just trying to catch her off guard. The best hooks are literally ones that people walk into. I know it sounds kind of weird, it's like, what do you mean they're going to walk into the hook? But because they're pathing, there's little tiny windows, but you need to predict it. it you can't do it when, uh... These guys should die here for sure. I'm not gonna take the kill or anything, I'm just gonna get her low. I don't know why this guy ulti, by the way, completely worthless when she has no flash. There's no way that she's gonna go away from us, so kinda weird, but okay. Make sure that you give me this cannon, please. Okay, cool. Ezreal actually tried to steal that. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that missed. It's okay. I'll just take plates here. I'll tank a little bit. Okay, cool. Every single time somebody looks for a dive, make sure that you're you're the first person to tank, especially maybe if you're not playing Sorak or something or Nami or something. Actually, even if you're one of those, it's good to get the auto attack off and sit on the side and wait. I don't have mana. Kind of troll. Okay, cool. We got her flash. Uh, Olaf messed up flash, but it's okay. The reason why I got back so much mana there for my hook was because of the Ocean Dragon, so that was pretty nice. I'll just buy Mobius here. Everybody can have a different playstyle about how they play certain champions, but for Bloodscrank, I just like... I mean, most people just rush Mobius, and you can sometimes even look to roam on like different lanes. I'd probably look to roam on mid here. Why are these guys so aggressive? I don't know like what they are doing. Like, they're just dead again. Like, okay.
Why well, I didn't get an assist there. My ulti actually didn't kill her. I was trying to get her. I don't want to give this guy the kill. Okay, I'm just gonna take it. I didn't know if Ezreal was gonna get it or not. <laughs> nice, I got my uh, support item too. I'm 150 ahead on this guy. I'm gonna put deep pink just because uh, we're so far ahead bot lane, we can just constantly kill these guys. They're like not playing well at all, so we should be able to abuse that. I can also roam it here, looks like we can pinch them maybe. I'll put down some vision. We see Talia's top side, so there's no way that they're on my side. There shouldn't be anybody, but I think they might kill her before I even arrive. Yeah, I'm... but it's okay, I can help them take this tower. I can use my demolished. Okay, so I'm just gonna back off. They can have most of the tower plating, it's fine. Thought to Leo rotate bot side. Oh. Oh wow. Nice juke. I'm just gonna clear the ward real fast. Once again, this guy is so far up for some reason. Alright, so I guess this game's already over. I mean... <laughs> whatever. No comment. The biggest mistake that Kaylin was making is just, like, stepping up hard no matter what. Like, I don't know why she always stepped up so hard, and then she would walk away from her minions so often against a Blitzcrank. It looks like she wasn't even trying to dodge my hooks, she was just giving me free opportunities, which is really weird. If you're ever against a Blitzcrank, don't do that. Oh shit, I pulled her. <laughs> I don't know if that was a good idea or not, but I'm out. Good luck. I'm, a I'm trying to knock this guy up. Oh. I get out. I'm so oom here, so I can't. I don't want to fight anymore. I do have an ocean dragon here if they actually do look for him. This guy, nice. I'll punch this guy out with you. Punch him out with you. Okay, wasn't able to. Oh wait, is there passive back up soon? Fuck. Okay, whatever. Damn it. Not my bonus gold, my 150 bonus gold. Alright, what should I go? I can literally go anything this game. Like, I feel like I can just roll. I mean, I use my... Uh, whatever, I won't go with Troll Build. This is actually a pretty good item for Blitzcrank, because, uh... It has a pretty low cooldown. This does, too. I mean, it has a cooldown, too, but... The cooldowns are pretty similar. It's 45 second cooldown, right? Yeah. And then my ulti is 50 seconds, so... Every single time we all end, it will just give us more damage. Me and the person. So, it's a pretty nice item for Blitzcrank. It makes it so I also... Yeah. Whoever's around me gets slowed, so it just helps out a lot. We can just kill these guys once again, probably because they're just always so far up for some reason. Oh, maybe not. Where's my Ezreal going? Come back. Can we kill her? Maybe not. I don't have hook up yet, so... In an Evil? There it is. Okay, I got her. You guys took the cannon again, why? Okay, my next hook is coming up soon, but we should be able to take this tower, and they're all running into the Cassiopeia, so... Oh, that would've landed. Feels bad. By the way, I didn't put a conduit on anybody. 
<laughs> uh, ignore that. Okay, they FF'd. Oh, wow. I actually thought that was going to land. I hope you guys enjoyed the commentary. It was a pretty weird game. Just don't do... I would say that just don't do what Caitlyn does more than I played well. Just like, if you're versus Blitzcrank, don't do those things. I'll see you guys next time.